Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, My Jewelry Addiction. My name is Tanya, and I'm addicted to jewelry. Whee! I went out and bought a few things. Oh, a little squeaky. Um, I went out and bought a few things uh, Monday night and yesterday morning. Um, oh yeah, I did get a couple of things this afternoon after I went to the post office. Hang on, let me go grab them. Okay, I'm back. Um, yeah, I went to one of my honey holes today, and I got this. Um, this does not appear to be a sterling silver um, clasp, but it's the most beautiful. I'm going to call it maybe a fluorite. could be just straight up amethyst, but I think it looks more like... Yeah, I don't know, there's some green in this too. So, fluorite, ametrine, I don't know. It's purple. It's pretty, I got it, I picked it up. I also got this one today. I need to look up this stone. Um, I could grab my book right now and decipher that one, but I don't feel like it. <laughs> um, yeah, it's got pearl and then it's got some green stone in there. And this one, I believe, is done with sterling silver. Looks like it. Beautiful necklace. I got this one here because I thought this was really pretty as well. Um, that's gorgeous. And then it has like onyx and pearls or... Oh... This has got a different color in it, too. It's got some green or some some sort of a chatoyance in there. I just noticed. Huh. And some little white seed pearls in between. I just thought that was really pretty. Um, so I got those from my honey hole. Tasha picked these out. These are sterling silver and onyx. And again, Tasha picked those. I thought they were really pretty. Whoops. And then yesterday morning, while Tasha was still packaging, I set out to my my real honey hole and I got a few things and uh, this is one of them I got these which are Christian Dior that I found in the wild and they're stunning they're beautiful earrings. And they are signed Christian Dior in the back. Don't pay attention to my nails. They look like they're in excellent, uh, like brand new condition. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Uh, I also picked this up because it was there, and why not? Good thing to have. Um, good thing to stack, stack these suckers. Got this one too. It's a 2020 Liberty coin. One 
troy ounce of fine 999 silver on both of these i got this little guy yesterday This is really pretty. I need to, I don't have my Lou, um, but I do need to look at that a little bit closer, but this is beautiful. This is like Peridot and Lapis and this beautiful cloisonne bead here. Really pretty necklace. Uh, this is a beautiful necklace too. This has got a gold filled lobster claw on there. Um, I don't think that that is original. I really don't. I, I think someone has added that. Um, it's the only thing about this that's gold tone. Everything else uh, is a silver tone metal that's been tarnished over the years. And this is beautiful glass. Blue green glass. Very pretty. Really pretty necklace. Um, I got this one here, which has got just this simple closure here. Um, and it's opal glass. Then it has these great rondelles with like a textured pearl almost like that Miriam Haskell type pearl. With the alternating colors, but it's very, very pretty. Real long, this one's like 56 inches long. Or 58, I can't remember. Gorgeous, had to have it, had to. I got this one here little coin purse, medicine bag, whatever you want to put in it. Cute little beaded purse slash necklace. Got that one. Got this here. I didn't get a whole bunch now, did I? Uh, this one's pretty. It does need to be cleaned, uh, but it's very pretty. And I said, yep, I better get that. Uh, this is metal and enamel with rhinestones, and I love the way that that's constructed. All the different, um, it's got different layers on there. Love the way that's put together. Really neat little brooch. Um, I don't think I showed you this brooch. Maybe I did. I don't recall, but cute. Cute, cute. Um, what else? Oh, I got these beautiful perfume bottles um, back at my honey hole. Uh, glass with a sterling silver, uh, whatever, design over the top of the glass. And this one seems to be stuck. Um, the stopper stuck in there, so I don't want to force it. Don't want to try to break it. Um, but I had one last week, and I went back there this week, and they ha actually had two. They had this red one and this one, and I took them both. I said yes, please. Uh, one of these is marked sterling here. I couldn't find the mark on the other one. But that's beautiful with the red. Very pretty. Got these. Um, I got these little earrings because I just thought they were the most beautiful. Super sweet little uh, glass beads. So I said, yeah. And I got this.
it's a big, huge panel bracelet. And look at that leopard or panther, leopard, <laughs> the cat. Um, he's cool. Look at his big old cleft chin. He's a handsome guy. And this is about two inches right here. Neat sterling bracelet. This is made in Peru. Um, it is silver. And it's pretty awesome. And lastly, on my um, outing yesterday, I got all of these beautiful hat pins. Uh, this one is sterling silver. This is glass beehive with a bee. This purple one is stunning. Um, this one is more than likely silver. Uh, I'm not, I'm not a hundred percent sure. I'm going to have to double, triple check that one. Um, I got this cute little bulldog because he is just adorable. I got a green glass um, bumblebee with the honeycomb. This one here is Gyoshi enamel and sterling silver. I got this one which is very much Art Nouveau. Beautiful. Um, I got the little Scotty dog because, I mean, come on. He's adorable. And uh, this one here is sterling silver stamped sterling. Um, and then the holder itself is by Limoges. Um, yeah, and I she has several of these and lots of hat pins. I, I showed you the four that I picked up last week. I went back yesterday morning um, at 10 a.m. when they opened and that's all I ended up buying. This is all I bought there was just hat pins and the holder. Um, and she's got more. So I'm waiting for her to bring out more so I can peek at those. Peek at you. Um, I also got this there uh, at the same honey hole. And I am going to do something fabulous with this. Uh, I thought with pearls and crystals and maybe some lighting in between it so it would light up. I think that would be gorgeous. Um, and then I got this one, which was also there. Um, same, I could do lighting, but I'm probably not. But because this is already, it's already got a bunch of detail in it, um, I am just going to, that's that weird fuzzy stuff from the, uh, you know, shipping boxes. Um, yeah, so I'm going to do this one probably in like a Christmas type scene, uh, traditional Christmas colors in that. And I think that is everything from my haul. I think so. That's it. That's all. I hope y'all had a ball. All right. You guys have a beautiful and blessed day. I uh, may as well show you these because they're here on my desk. Um. You guys have a beautiful and blessed day, and I hope to see you again um, very soon. Yeah, I got everything shipped out today, if you guys um, didn't know. if you, you should have gotten an email from Pirate Ship that your shipment is on the way. Um, yeah, thank you, everyone. It was uh, a great week last week. It was a whole lot of fun. Actually, it was this week, Sunday, Monday. <laughs> oh, I got this, too. How did you get way over there? Isn't that cute? It's just a furry little brooch. And I didn't want to leave it behind. Yep. So that was it. That was everything. Okay, you guys, uh, I'll see you again very soon. Ta-ta.